has built his winning streak in BKFC on patience. Yeah, but when you got a guy rock like that, it's hard not to jump all over him and take him out. You got to be careful with that counter coming, though. That's exactly what Dyer's corner was telling him. He needs to count on these punches and make him pay every time he comes in. Not reckless, though, from Hunt. No, very patient. Back into the rhythm. 70 seconds remaining around three. Dyer down, final seconds of round number one, down here early stages of round three. And Hunt, true to his word of patience, not jumping into the pocket, not trying to open up recklessly for the third round finish, Chris. There's a left hand from Dyer. Yeah, there was something different that time when he hurt his opponent. He didn't really, he seemed like he hopped up and recovered a lot quicker than Josh Dyer. Dyer loading up that right hand, continuing to range find the jab, hold the right hand back. Overhand right on the duck under from Hunt. Dyer's not able to let go of that punch, though. He's pulling with the jab, he's waiting for that right hand, but he's not finding the time to load, let it go. Dyer might have lost his left eye contact lens again. You saw the awkward blink with the left eye. Hunt now stepping into the pocket with a huge elbow. Might have lost his left eye contact lens again. You saw the awkward blink with the left eye. Hunt now stepping into the pocket. Load, let it go. Dyer might have lost his left eye contact lens again. You saw the awkward blink with the left eye. Hunt now stepping into the pocket with a huge uppercut. Whoa. Left eye contact lens again. You saw the awkward blink with the left eye. Hunt now stepping into the pocket with a huge uppercut. Second knockdown of Dyer here in round three. Four, He's just saying you can't five, see him. You know that's the kid to death. If you're telling the referee seven, you can't see, eight, can you the continue? fight's going to be seven. over. Step towards me. Time. Dyer it's asked contact, the free Gabe Barahona, can I put my contact in? And Barahona is going to allow it. Quickly, quickly, uh, quickly. I, I, I'm not sure quickly. if I've seen that before. but I have never seen that. Quickly. I mean, what are you gonna do? I mean, they're yelling at them quickly, but I don't know. I mean, right. turn around, turn around, turn around, gentlemen. Let's knuckle up. No complaint from Lorenzo Hunt. I mean, what are you gonna say there? The referee said it was all right. That's the end of round number three. Ta 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 ta. Back to your quarters. Knuckle up. It knocked him down, but Josh Dyer was fine after that fight. Dyer down twice in round number three. To round number four we go. And you can just tell how supremely confident Lorenzo Hunt feels right now. Dyer's corner calling for urgency. Uh, as they should. You cannot continue to go at this pace. You're going to lose. He's got to come forward right now to Dyer. He's not able to come forward at any time. He's got to throw combinations. I want to see some one, two, threes. You've got to end with that hook. You have to do something different. Turn it under to an uppercut with his head down. And the pawing with the left jab from Dyer, open-handed. Stepping in again, there's the counter right hand from Dyer circling out. Dyer saw this overhand right, and it's going way over his opponent's head. He needs to turn that underneath to an uppercut. See the duck under the level change from Hunt. There's the right hand. 65 seconds remaining, round four. I'd like to see that leaping. Patterson left hook thrown by Dyer. He's not really utilizing that, that hook at all. It's all jab, but it's not even a hard step jab. It's just a feeler jab. His opponent has nothing to worry about from it. I'm being very patient here in round number four after dropping Dyer twice in round three. <laughs> to the body with the left hook. Control the rhythm, going back to the opening stages of this fight. Exactly, look who's back right hand. Dyer in trouble once more, bounce against the ring ropes. He does not the glove. I mean, you can't say Dyer's not getting the best advice possible from his corner. It's just much harder to do that than it is, it, it sounds like. I mean, it's great advice, hard to do though. Hunt knows that unless he is finished in this fifth round, this fight is his. I mean, and you can just see Dyer went backwards. Step in right hand from Hunt. There's the left hand. Dyer in trouble once more, covering up. Oh, Hunt now finishes the the moment. Big shots and down. Left hand, Dyer went backwards. Step in when he's throwing that jab, he pulled away at the same time. He's stepping forward with the punch, but his head's moving backwards. Step in right hand from Hunt. There's the left hand. Dyer Trouble once more covering up. Oh, Hunt now finishes the moment. Big shots and down. 
open backwards. Step in right hand from Hunt. There's the left hand. Dyer in trouble once more. Covering up. Oh, oh no. Finish the moment. Big shots. Down goes Dyer. Fourth time in this fight. One, two, three. Four. Dyer with the left hand. Dyer with the left hand. You ready to go? Step towards me. Step towards me. Brennan, Josh right, Dyer. Right, gentlemen. Yeah, Off of the hand. Uh, what is in you? Towards me. Brennan, Josh right, Dyer. Right, gentlemen. Yeah, Off of the hand. Uh, Six, seven, eight. You ready to go? Step towards me. Step towards me. Brennan, Josh right, Dyer. Right, gentlemen. Yeah, Off of the hand. What is in you? He's done. He's done. Again, struggling with the left eye contact lens. This time, Gabe Barahona will not allow him to put in another lens. That is the end of the fight. Lorenzo Hunt just keeps on rolling. Ladies and gentlemen, our referee in charge, Gabe Barahona, steps in and calls a stop to the fight. And 52 seconds into round number five for your winner by TKO, Lorenzo the Juggernaut. Oh!